Hi. I wanted to do a video on DNA. DNA disaster. Maybe, maybe not. Um, one of the things that I think about and would like to relay, I guess, is families should talk more. I wish that when I was growing up that I would have talked to my mom and found out what she was like growing up. What was it like for her? What did she do? Different things like that. Now, granted, we had a very dysfunctional family. Both my parents were alcoholics. So I never did get to know who my father was. I mean, I knew who knew him, but I didn't know anything about my parents that much other than what other family members have told me. And there was always that skeleton in the closet. So, and then my sister would sit there and say that she never felt like part of the family. Um, she always felt like an outsider. So I had a friend for different reasons talk me into doing a DNA test. And just for kicks and giggles, I guess, I went ahead and had my kids do it. I went ahead and got a kit for my sister and pretty much the whole family ended up taking it. So when it came back, my really good friend that I call a DNA detective because she is so into that and understands all the numbers and everything contacted me and told me that my sister <clears throat> was my half sister. So her feelings were justified, I guess you could say. And But then she continued to tell me that our father, who I thought was my dad, was not my dad, but was not my sister's dad either. So we had, we both had totally different dads. And that hurt. I mean... It really did hurt. I, I was I was extremely upset. My father, who I thought was my biological dad, was a Navy commander, and I wanted to know more about him. And it just was strange because I <clears throat> now I find out that he's not my dad. Not that I didn't want to find out more about him, but. It was just really hard. I was upset for the longest time. I don't think it fazed my sister that much. The thing is, is that um, the whole family took this test. And come to find out, I'm 51% Jewish. Nobody in the family, nobody um, has that trait, I guess. So my DNA detective friend ended up and it's taken years to find out who my father is. He's not alive, but I did find out who he is. And I have family in Virginia that I would like to get to know better. Not that it's going to be some warm and fuzzy reunion, but I still would like to go and meet them and try to learn a little bit about my background. And I just think kids today really need to talk to their parents, get to know them, know how they grew up. I think we all go off in our own little worlds anymore today that as we get older and we think about those things, it's too late. Now I do live with my uncle. I'm his caregiver and um, it's not the best situation. This house is over, it's a hundred years old, so it's that's a whole other story, but he's told me stories because he is my mother's brother. So I am learning through him, but it still is not the same when you are able to sit down and talk to your parents. So I suggest strongly, have any of you had a DNA test? Do you have a story to tell? What is your thoughts on finding out your results? I'd like to hear about it.
let me know. That was just a little tidbit for today, and I hope you all have a good night, and I'll talk to you later. Thank you. And please press like and subscribe. I would really appreciate it. Bye.